Hi everybody, it's Mike Marco speaking. And today I want to talk to you about something that I've been thinking about for quite a while. And uh, it's about people having choices about their lifestyle and the life they want to live. Now there's really, in my opinion, there's probably three different types of people out there. There are the people that are uh, feel like they're trapped, that they're stuck, and that they're victims of, uh, of their circumstances and, and their life. There are people that are comfortable, they're doing fairly well. And those are people, and there are also people that are supercharged and having an amazing, abundant life. Now, let's go ahead and talk about the first group, the people that feel are trapped. These are the people that are, um, they feel really down, they feel like they're, they're, um, uh, they're victims of circumstances. They're, the typical calling or the reply from uh, people like this or like, there's something like, uh, you don't know what I'm going through, you don't know how tough it is for me, um, and that type of verbiage. And really by saying stuff like that, they were really self-perpetuating their circumstances. Instead of taking charge and taking ownership, they're, they're portraying more of that victim mentality. And really it takes a, 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 a mindset change to really to break out of that because they can't, people can't really help them to, to break out of it, they really have to do it, they have to want to do it themselves. And something has to happen inside themselves to want to break through and move to the next group. And before they be able to start taking action. And those type of people that might be going back to school, that might be taking some dramatic action to uh, maybe start their own business. Something just to break free of the balance because they feel like they're caged, they feel like they're trapped. And, and they feel pretty helpless, and that's why they feel victims, and they feel like, like uh, they don't know what to do. So they really, it takes something deep inside, this, the, basically the, the click, the change, in order for them to move to the next group. The next group, they're doing pretty good, okay? They, when they first move into this group, they're feeling, they're pretty happy, they might be uh, having the income they're looking for, they feel comfortable, they have, uh, maybe they have a couple cars, they have a nice house, and they're doing pretty good. They're feeling pretty good about life. And then, and then someone comes up and says, how are you doing? And they answer, mm, I'm okay. And really at that point, in that phase in uh, someone, it's basically they are realizing that they haven't really achieved everything they want to. They realize they're feeling comfortable, but there's something missing. Like they don't feel supercharged as when they first came into this particular kind of group. They don't have, the, 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 they're starting to, the money is nice, but there's a feeling that deep down inside there's something more. And so they're not quite sure what to do. They feel like, again, they kind of feel like kind of in a rut, kind of feeling people, this kind of verbiage people hear people say. Yet they just, just don't feel, even though everybody from externally may say they look very successful, they the deep down inside they realize there's something more. There's something they can really achieve to have a real prosperous life they feel like they deserve and they really want. And again, something has to, has to change, something has to click inside to really want them to, to switch to become more of a supercharged group, a really energized and prosperous group. Something has to really kind of click inside them to take them, again, kind of give them that paradigm shift to the next group. This is where, the next group is where you have the supercharged. This is where you have the super achievers. People look at them and say, wow, I just, there's no way I can ever be like that. And, and really, everybody has it deep down inside. They just haven't really had that click inside to take them to that prosperous lifestyle. It, it really, it takes like, I don't know, it just, it's like they've gone from the rut, they've gone outside the rut, they've gone past that, and suddenly everything starts falling into place. They feel supercharged, and each step, each step, step of progress they make really fuels the energy they need to move forward and take the next step and it starts building momentum so once you get past that that second stage and start moving into the more phosphorus every every single accomplishment starts supercharging you and it could be small things maybe small uh, conversation increases it could be progress in the business could be it could be anything it could be writing the books that you're writing in the right and just anything kind of taking the further steps forward and each step starts fueling the next step which fuels the next step and then so on to the point where you build this momentum and you have this before you know it you have this huge prosperous lifestyle built up around you and 
that you feel supercharged and you have an amazing life. So that's the thing is that sometimes when people are, feel that step from either group and they're not quite sure what to do, that's where sometimes it actually helps to have a coach to help them walk through and take them to the next step. So um, I would really strongly encourage people to look out there, see if they can find someone maybe to kind of help them give them that little boost that they need and help themselves have a more prosperous and amazing life. That's it for now. I'll talk to you later.